Right, what's happening people? I am um, Bodybuilding Made Simple back with another vlog. Now, this one is more of a review. Excuse the extra sound. Hold up. Right, so this is more of a review that I really wanted to make on the Rich Piano Chronicles documentary because obviously I'm a massive Rich Piano fan, as I've mentioned in all of my videos, all my posts, and whatnot if you follow all that social media stuff. So I fucking love it, Rich Piano, what he stands for, like, all that stuff. I followed him since he was in Newton, so I was literally like 18 and just went to university all the way through his transition into 5% and all the other shit. So I wanted to review this for people that feel the same way about the whole movement and the ones who show they want to spend their money on watching this documentary because we've all seen so much of Rich Piano. So you're kind of wondering, am I going to spend like 10 quid on like watching the same shit just compiled into one video or not and this is essentially a brief review to tell you what can you expect to get for that tenner that you're going to spend so <sighs> mashing up the knuckles a little freebie man a little no carb um, coffee Caribbean drink got that body power in that is but anyway let's, let's cut through this right so um Bell me a second. Okay. Right, so here's the little screen share to show you where you can find it. I'm um, this ain't like the purpose of this video is not to be like advertising or any of that bullshit. This is purely to give people that wanna fucking buy it or are wondering whether to do that shit. A little overview of what my thoughts are as a dead like die hard fan. What do I think, alright? Because Obviously, like most of you lot, I checked out some reviews and whatnot, and um, and my thoughts, um, I wasn't too sure whether I should fucking buy it or not, and um, a lot of people, like, for some weird reason on here, I think it's maybe because I've made the purchase, the reviews aren't appearing, it says no customer reviews, but there was some reviews, I did, I did read some reviews, some of them were on social media, like on YouTube or Instagram and whatever, because... Um, it's Generation Iron that did the documentary, so it's the same guys that did Generation Iron 1, 2 and 3, same guys that did the Unbroken for Callum and a bunch of other documentaries, but yeah, so reviews were a bit mixed, a lot of people were saying this is shit, this is whatever, it's just a bunch of videos fucking put into one and you just Rich Piano fucking, it's the same thing, you just go on his YouTube channel and watch the same old stuff, fair enough, okay, so I made the purchase, watched the whole thing twice, and I was actually just going through fucking watching it again. He's just so nice, man. So refreshing to actually watch some fresh rich piano shit, considering Giz is obviously not here anymore. And um, it used to be a daily routine watching his stuff. And being able to watch some stuff that I haven't seen again is proper, like, motivating, proper reboosts the way uh, the video used to make me feel. Without getting too soppy. Uh, yeah, so my personal opinion, absolutely worth watching it worth the purchase. I'm not I don't think Generation Iron are the probably the best like I mean the geese are doing some great shit, right? But I personally thought Generation Iron 3 was pretty shit. But that's because I didn't really know a lot of the guys. I wasn't really like I'm not really that involved with a lot of the new people. I should be maybe, maybe I'm wrong, but as a fan, I think Generation Iron one and then two were the best ones. Three, in my opinion, was a bit of a flop. But it's a good documentary for someone that doesn't have a clue, but as a fan, I didn't really find that that cool. So I definitely doubted watching this, as I saw Generation Iron 3 beforehand. But, having seen um, the Rich Piano Chronicles, I can only say, it's honestly, man, honestly, it's absolutely amazing. Um, it gives you a lot, some stuff are coming out of uh, Generation Iron 2, so I do expect to see that. But it's almost, put it this way, um, Vlad, so the guy Generation Iron, has filmed... Um, for let's say two, three days following Rich Piano, doing a bunch of stuff, talking to him about his personal life before bodybuilding, during bodybuilding, during working for companies, then doing his own company, uh, what his lifestyle was like before or after, personal life shit, and he's only been able to cut and dice and take some of the main bits for the main documentary, as he's got other bodybuilders. This is basically the full thing from that whole uh, filming experience he's had with him, and. Um, I'm not going to show you like a massive preview because I think that's just mugging off the whole idea of them selling it. But um, a little, I can show you like a little clip, I guess. Uh, so let me go back to here. So it's kind of segmented into little things like this. Hey, what's up, brother? What up, 
Ready to fucking kill it? Right. Truck. I just fucking ate it. Cause you did them guys fucking fell, fell out. Um, ready! <laughs> Look at you with... Okay, so this is just a little sign to show you. So it's genuinely like a proper documentary. There's following Rich Piana, checking him out. He, he is the crazy one. Yeah, Rich Piana is definitely the crazy one. Yeah, he's 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 definitely the crazy one. And you just sort of you were able to visualize how he was picking up pace and what he was doing and how much more shit he would have been doing, but um, <clears throat> but yeah. So I'm gonna roll a little clip for some of the guys. If obviously for some reason you may not be aware of Rich Piano is, you may have just randomly landed on this video. This is a little taste of uh, Rich Piano. It's one of my favorite tribute videos by uh, Machiavelli Motivation. Good fucking morning, everyone. Yeah, I am fucking back. Can you believe it? Don't be saying, oh shit, Rich is done, Rich is, oh no, this shit is never gonna end, Rich is never fucking done, you guys should know that shit, until they bury my motherfucking ass, I am never gonna be done, I'm gonna keep doing what I do, until someone fucking puts me six feet under, I'm gonna keep doing what I do, I'm gonna keep going on and on and on and on, shit's never gonna stop, I've always been a bodybuilder, bodybuilder at heart, you know, about the physique, about developing the most incredible physique, when I was a youngster, and that's all I cared about, was someday being on the Olympia stage, competing with the best in the world, and uh, I never made it. Thank God. <laughs> but you know, this is the this is the fucking mentality of a goddamn fucking bodybuilder. You know, you get obsessed with getting bigger. You get obsessed with reaching your goal, and you know, you take it too far. And that's what the fuck I did. Tell me what's up. Tell me how it is, because. You know, I got nothing, nothing to hide. I'll tell you exactly whatever the fuck's going on. You know, the whole point was to just show people that anything's possible, that you can do anything you set your mind to. What you have to be able to do is you have to be able to to take this and use it in all aspects of life and realize that everything is that easy. As long as you're willing to do whatever the fuck it takes and you're motivated and you get up in the morning and you push all day long, Towards achieving that goal, that anything can be accomplished. It's gonna pay off, but you gotta fucking hang in there. And you can do it. I know you can do it. If I can fucking do it, you can fucking do it. You know what I mean? I'm not giving up. So you guys aren't gonna give up either. We're gonna do this together all the way to the fucking end. Don't ever be skeptical. Don't ever, don't ever question. Don't ever, you know, I don't know or I can't or don't ever be negative. You know, always positive and always believe. Yes, you can believe to achieve. That's the key. This is a little, little bit of flavor, man. This is basically the type of content he was putting on a daily basis. Oh, speaks about that on a daily basis, and this is the type of shit that we used to watch. Some people like me still watch, and um, unfortunately, some people may miss that one. But I'm gonna make another video of. Kind of compiling a lot of the times I've met Rich Piana, some of the videos where I've spoken to Rich Piana, they're not very good quality because they're like some of the ones are like from literally five six years ago, well not that long, four or five years ago, and uh, yeah, but it'd be pretty cool to like put it out there, and um, yeah, I think uh, I think the documentary is definitely worth the um, worth the purchase, definitely worth the watch, and if you're a sort of fan like fan like me, like you proper like love the gears, I love love the whole five percent movement. You're gonna fucking enjoy it, man. So, yeah, it's worth it. If you're based in the UK, the thing cost me about seven nine seven. Hold on. Okay, can't see the price anymore, but yeah, things about seven ninety nine or eight pound ninety nine. So it's even just under a ten pound. So man, it's worth it. It's worth fucking watching that shit. And uh, yeah, let me know what you think if you have seen it and you you think um, perhaps I don't know it's not as good as I'm saying it is or you think it's even better. Whatever, just let me know, man. Drop me a message on social media or on YouTube on the comments below. Whatever, it'd be fucking sick to hear what you think. And anyway, on that note, I'm gonna wrap up. Let me know your thoughts and yeah, look forward to it.